really sad to leave Esperance this morning. We've been there for a couple of weeks. Some of the most amazing beaches that we've seen in Australia. Uh, but we've arrived at Mullingup. Is that right? Mungluinup. Mungluinup, our first up place. We've got a lagoon right outside our caravan, um, about 50 metres walk away. And just going to walk around, check out some shells, go for a swim, do some paddle boarding. Should be a fun few days. This is where our caravan is, right next to the beach. You got a fish tummy? Yeah. Uh, we just rocked up in Bremer Bay and how's this for the life? Come down, park straight on the beach, sit in front of the car, watch the kids, read a book, and enjoy life. Bremer Bay, pretty good so far. Tom, what's that over there? A lot of poo and a lot of birds. Oh, gross. Keep going! We're at Colgan River Caravan Park near Albany. It's our first cold day in six months. What'd you do today? I'm going a 14k walk. How's that? Um, Mac feet hurt. Why did you do that? Um, because I want to get 30,000 steps on my watch by the end of the day. So I get a chocolate bar. <laughs> Today I got 30,000 steps on my watch, and now I get a chocolate bar. A whole block of chocolate. Yeah. What are you going to get? Um, marvellous creations. <laughs> if I get this golf ball that I found in that hole, over there, um, Dad too will give me five bucks, and Bum will give me five bucks, so that's ten bucks. Not a chance. Yeah. Just spent three nights here at Kelgan River. Uh, didn't quite get to do as much as we were hoping because it just rained and it was really cold most of the time. So uh, unfortunately a bit of van time, but we still got our steps up and saw all the kangaroos and stuff. But uh, moving on to a bit of a fancy big four in Albany now. So hopefully that's fun. Another one going. This is nature's bridge. We're at Misery Beach today, just having a bit of lunch. Uh, one of the websites recently rated this as the number one beach in Australia, which it is a beautiful beach. It is very nice, but we've seen a lot of great beaches and. Tommy, is it number one? No. Nah, it's probably not even top ten in Southwest WA. It's beautiful though, look at the view. Islands, beautiful sand. Nice big rock face, beautiful spot for lunch, but uh, not number one. Just 
drive to the next stop on our journey, which is Denmark. We're gonna be here for about a week. Forecast isn't great, but it's blue skies today, so we'll try and explore as much as we can. We're about a uh, one minute drive from our campsite. There's this amazing river down here, just perfect for paddle boarding, perfect for fishing. Uh, pretty nice place down here at Denmark Wilson's Inlet. Uh, there's a beach just around the corner. It's beautiful. Wow, Jamesy, first proper fish of the trip. Yeah, first fish. <laughs> Biggest highlight of Denmark is definitely Greens Pool. Been pretty excited to get here. Top 10 beaches in Australia. Uh, weather's not great today, and I think that the clouds just not letting us see. It's true beauty, but it's pretty cool here. Happy anniversary, babe. Thanks. 12 years. Pretty exciting. Very exciting. Uh, pretty glad to have been with you for 12 years, making memories. It's been hard, but I've been good. <laughs> we are at Greens Pool today. This is take two for Greens Pool. It's a bit sunnier today. Beautiful weather here, clear water. Uh, a few more people on the beach today, though. But uh, beautiful, romantic day on the beach, except for these. Except for those guys. <laughs> hey James. What? Hey! I'll do that back to you! No! Tommy? Really good. Love it. Been in the Denmark Big Four for the last eight nights. Uh, we didn't quite plan on there being a public holiday right in the middle of that, that stay, so I went from about 20% full up to 100% full for a few days. It's pretty crazy around here. Heaps of people on carts, kids everywhere. Super busy. But uh, this is one of our favorite parks that we've ever stayed at. There's just so much to do here. So much for the kids. It's definitely the biggest park we've ever stayed at. And uh, definitely recommend this place. We've just arrived at Fonty's pool. We'll be staying here for the next three nights. This pool is in our caravan park. It's pretty cool.
this place is amazing. It's got like tires for a hunt you can float on. Um, it's got a jumping bridge. It's just crazy. Today we're on the Kari Forest Drive near Pemberton. Uh, we're going to go check out these beautiful forests, uh, drive around, there's like a tourist drive. Uh, perfect day for it. Uh, excited. Hey Tommy, that uh, tree behind us, it's 59 metres high. Do you reckon I should climb it? No. Oh, come on, please let me. No. You can't stop me. Ah! This is the view from the top of the Gloucester tree. It's uh, 53 metres high. Used to be a lookout for fires in the area. Uh, just climbed the 53 metre tree. It was scary, um, shaking a little bit. Not looking forward to going down. Uh, it's pretty high. Probably can't see quite how high that is, but. This is Big Brook Dam. How is your chocolate, Tommy? This is, um, the chocolate normal level. And the, um, my chocolate was out of the level. <laughs> out of this world. Coffee's pretty good too. Cheers. Cheers. We saw a snake. I was the like first one to see it, and I thought it was a lizard. It was so scary. Um, I was pretty scared. How was Tom? Um, he like walked as far as he could away. Thanks for watching. Join us next time when we go to Margaret River. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>